Hey Bro Chicas and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I have a really exciting video idea. As you can tell from the title, I'm going to be showing you today that the number on the tag does not matter. Let me say that again for the ones in the back. The number on the tag does not matter. And I'm going to prove to you that your number size means nothing. So let's get into it. I came up with this idea, uh, I want to say like a week ago, because I bought two different pairs of jeans and they were two completely different sizes. And I was thinking to myself, these are way bigger than the sizes I have at home that fit me. What's going on here? I have one, one, two, three, four, five different sizes. Five. I have five different sizes to show you and they all fit me the same. Okay. That's crazy. Now let's just talk about it, guys. I know a lot of women, a lot of women get down about the size on the tag. They think, oh my God, like I'm this size. I can't believe that. That's so embarrassing. Lie about the weight. Lie about the number on the tag. Why? Because it's all fake. It's literally all fake. And I cannot wait to prove this to you. Pair of shorts, number one, stretchy denim, okay? These are very, very high-waisted. They fit me perfectly. They're very, very comfortable. They're not too tight. These are from Shein, by the way. And I love these jeans. They fit awesome. Now, these are a size 1XL, and I will prove it to you. I want to make sure that y'all know 1XL. I'm not lying or I'm not capping. Is that what the young kids say? I ain't capping. No cap. All right. <laughs> Don't make fun of me. <laughs> I watch too much TikTok. So these fit perfectly. They are so comfortable. Now wait. I have these babies right here also from Shein. They are also stretchy denim and they are also a size one XL and they're tight on me size one XL and they're tight on me and I'm gonna show you right now. Yes, we're doing this, we're doing this. Now these, <sighs> these ones are tight. Okay, you can clearly see that these are tight on me. I mean, this it's not comfortable. Like I can get it buttoned and I can get it zipped but it's not desirable. It's not a desirable fit. It feels way too tight in this part. The rest feels good, but this part feels way too tight. Um, yeah, you can just see the bulge coming out. You can see that the zipper is starting to like bust open. Like these are struggling. That's more comfortable. But this right here, yes, that's where it fits. This is how much room <laughs> It's too tight for me. So I uh, just wanted to show you that even even from the same brand, even the same kind of product, denim stretchy shorts, the same size, and they don't fit me the same. So that's one way I wanted to prove to you that the number doesn't matter because yes, there's fabric content, there's the amount of the elastane that's in there, there's whether they're worn or whether they're structured denim, there's so many factors that go into clothes and that's why we cannot care about the number or the letter on our tags because there's way too many factors that determine how it's going to fit your body, you know? But I thought it was interesting because these are both supposed to be a tight, stretchy denim and they fit me very differently. Exhibit B <laughs> or C, we're on the third pair. This is a third pair of shorts. This is a size 3 XL and I don't know where the tag went I don't know if these ever had a tag I don't know but these are also from Shein please trust me guys I wouldn't lie to you okay I wouldn't lie to you I'm making this making this video for the thick girls okay these are a size 3x and the reason why they're a size 3x is because I ordered them in a 1x which was my typical size in shorts um, the 1X ended up fitting me like a size 10. 
And so I actually gave it to my best friend who is my neighbor and she wears them all the time. If only she was here, she could prove it to y'all because she's got the same exact shorts and a size 1XL because I gave them to her. So I was like, well, assuming like how those fit me, I feel like I'd have to go up at least two sizes, not one size. And I've never gone up to a 3XL, never have had to do that. I had to go up to a 3XL for these babies to fit. And let me show you, they do fit perfectly and they are a 3XL. They fit me like a 1XL. Why? I don't know. Because they're denim. Um, they don't have too much stretch, but they're also loose fitting. Like it's supposed to be a relaxed fit. Okay. Actually, these are a little on the tight side, to be honest with you. They're not as tight as that second pair of denim, but they're supposed to be paper bag waist. Okay, they're high waisted just like the other ones. They definitely fit, these are definitely more comfortable than the last pair, but they're, you know, they're snug right here. And these are a 3XL. Like what? <laughs> how does that make any sense? Like people who make clothes in this world, how does that make sense to you? That a 1XL, and a 3XL fit me the exact same. Look, the proof is in the pudding. There's no extra. There is no extra room. These are cute. But yeah, these fit and they're a 3XL. How? I don't know. Whew, I'm out of breath. Now, I wanted to throw in a little bit of spice. And I wanted to show you a skirt. I thrifted this skirt. This is a vintage skirt and it is a size 12. I am not a size 12. <laughs> Evident by 3XL and 1XL. I am not a size 12. Here we go. Clearly says size 12. This is definitely a vintage tag, but it has a little last elastic waist. This part is obviously not stretchy. It's like scarf material. But I'm gonna try this on for you. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, what, what, what is that? Does it actually fit me? <laughs> what? Okay, so let's be real though. Um, it probably was supposed to go down here. It was probably in the intention, um, but I can set it up on my waist and actually fit into it. Mm-hmm. Size 12. This is a size 14, 16 body. And I can put this size 12 skirt on. This part doesn't stretch. How does this fit? Maybe it was supposed to be, I don't know. Maybe it was supposed to be longer and more flowier. But I, I still think this is a really cute outfit. Um, I love the band t-shirt with the skirt vibe. It's so cute. And here's how it looks on my stomach. Still a little bit of room, honestly. So just wanted to show you again, size doesn't matter. Um, when you're thrifting, when you're shopping, like in store, try, if you can try on, I know not all the dressing rooms are open. I know Old Navy, American Eagle, and Walmart, the dressing rooms are open. Um, with thrifting, I do a trick where I put it around my neck to see if it's going to fit or I just, I just buy it and hope that it fits. But I guess what I'm trying to say here is, don't be afraid to try different sizes and see what fits you because it doesn't matter what it says on the tag. Don't be embarrassed by the number. Don't take it so seriously. Just wear what fits you because whatever actually fits your body nicely is going to compliment you and you're gonna look gorgeous. As long as it fits you and compliments your body, you're gonna look gorgeous. Who cares if it's a 1X? Who cares if it's a 4X or a 5X? Who cares? If it fits you, wear it okay so let's get into pants i have a couple of pairs of pants to show you guys and these are by the brand lee and i got these at walmart they do have a little bit of stretch to them but they're a thicker structured i mean no they're stretchy but they're like a thicker denim they're not like super thin these are mid-rise and these are size 18 petite and i know it's going to be hard to see I'm trying to like 
minimize the reflection. Okay, so it says 18P. These are 18 petite and they fit me perfectly. And it's probably because they're petite, but I'm just saying, like when you're shopping, you know, open up your mind. Think outside the box. If you really wanted something and they didn't have your size, um, the size that you think you are, try some other things on. Luckily, I'm short. So I was able to fit into these 18 petites. Um, when I was looking for a 16, they didn't have a 16. And these fit me like a glove, girl. Yeah, no extra room. I need lower waist to panties, so don't mind me. Um, but yeah, these fit me like a glove. And these are some flare jeans. It's hard for me to show you. But yeah, these fit so comfortably. And these are a size 18. I've never worn an 18 in my life, but they fit. They fit, they fit, they fit, they fit, they fit. What you gonna do when they fit it? You wear it, wear it, wear it, wear it. Next up, we have a structured denim. Okay, this is the 90s classic type of pants by the brand. Free assembly from Walmart. So they call these the classic 90s straight fit they are a structured denim straight leg supposed to be like a mom jean very friends era and these my friends are in a size 20. am i a size 20? i don't shop in a size 20 but these fit me and i'm gonna show you oh. okay This button is really hard to get on. <laughs> okay, so we have like a semi high rise. You know, it's not like the highest rise I have, but it is a high rise. They fit. They fit. Do they not look like the same fit right here as the last jeans? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I told you. What is going on, America? <laughs> America, <laughs> how are, <laughs> what are you trying to do to us? They are messing up our mental health, let me tell you. Luckily, <laughs> your girl has gotten very healthy mentally and I'm not gonna let this F with my brain and you shouldn't let it F with your brain either. I don't care, it's a size 20 and, and what? I'm thick and what? I don't care if these are a size 20, I don't care if they're a size 12. If they fit me, they feel good, they look good. It shouldn't freaking matter, right? Shouldn't matter. And I'm yelling at y'all, cause you, you need to understand this and you need to be confident and wear these sizes with pride. Cause nobody cares, nobody cares, nobody cares. Nobody cares. I have one more pair of pants to show you guys to prove to you <laughs> that size on the tag means nothing, okay? These are from Nasty Gal. I still have the tag on them because I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with them. They don't fit me. By the way, this shirt is from Nasty Gal also, if you're wondering. This is a size US 18, UK 22. US 18, okay? Smaller than these pants. These are a 20. <gasps> Can't unbutton that. Now I know that these are a different fabric, but I still disagree with all of these sizes that are supposed to be the same, being all across the board like this. It's kind of ridiculous. All right, these are a size 18. They look okay, but they're definitely too big. This all right here. We got all this extra right here, okay? They could go like, bro. <laughs> These are too big on me. Definitely too big. They're supposed to fit like this. I don't know, I might still wear them, but there is a lot of left leftover as you can see. 
yeah, you can really see like that. There's a lot of extra fabric here. So I just wanted to show you that last one. These are size 18. They are still big on me. That is going to conclude today's video, my friends. And I really hope that you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you want more videos like these. Inspirational. Love your body. Again, for the people in the back, love your body. You're beautiful. You guys are gorgeous. I love you all. Thank you for your continued support. Honestly, it's because of y'all that I'm so confident. Y'all have helped me tremendously and you don't even know it. And I just want to share that back with you. I want you to be just as confident as anybody should be. You should love yourself. Life is too damn short. Wear what you want to wear. Doesn't matter about the number. Who cares? Who cares? So I really hope that y'all enjoyed this again. Um, please don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already for more fashion content. And I will see you beautiful people in the next video.